Coming up next on Auto Show TV, we check out the major construction project going on at Cerrone's in South Attleboro. Victoria takes us to Colonial Toyota for a walk around of the Toyota Sienna. Plus, she stops at Anchor Subaru for a look at the Crosstrek. Also, our best buys with some great deals and a look in at Ted's Auto Sales in Somerset. All that and more next on Auto Show TV. It's Auto Show TV. Good morning, welcome to Auto Show TV. I'm John Coletto. We're here at Cerrone's in South Attleboro. They've begun a major construction project. They're building a new showroom across the street from their current facility. We'll be talking to Al Cerrone about this project in just a few minutes. But first, we start at Colonial Toyota in Smithfield. Here's Victoria Moran. Good morning. We're here at Colonial Toyota in Smithfield. When it comes to keeping the family safe and comfortable on the roads, parents want the very best. And for those who want the practicality of a minivan, you can get it all in the Toyota Sienna. The 2014 Toyota Sienna is an auto intelligence top pick for a variety of reasons. Its powerful V6 engine provides good gas mileage. Sienna's safety technology is outstanding. It's comfortable for the kids, seats up to eight, plenty of storage, three zone climate control, and lots more. And you don't have to have kids to see that the Sienna is as versatile and intelligent as any vehicle on the road. Joining us again this morning is Amanda Sperry. Amanda, there's a lot to talk about with the Sienna, so let's get started. All right, well today we're gonna to be looking at the 2015 Sienna. This is the LE front wheel drive. It does come front wheel drive and all wheel drive with achieving 18 to 25 miles per gallon for the front wheel drive and 16 and 23 miles per gallon for the all wheel drive. That's pretty good. Yeah, it is pretty great. The vehicle has tons of versatility, has lots of storage, lots of safety features, so I definitely want to get started and show you everything that it has to offer. So with the Sienna LE, we are going to have automatic opening doors on our push fob on our key as well, so we can access the back seats very easily. So let me show you a little bit about how these seats work back here, because there's a lot to see. Um, you're going to have captain's chairs, which the armrests can come down, making it much more comfortable for your rear passengers. Your seats can be reclined, of course, for extra comfort. They also can move forward or back to be able to give your third row passengers more leg room. And these seats also can come out, so depending on, you know, if you need to put a lot of storage in here, if you're moving something, um, they can actually just roll out by pulling this lever, lever here and these seats can fully come out all the way and this can all be storage. So back here we're going to be looking at the third row seats with the uh, tremendous amount of storage space that we have when the seats are up as well as down. I'm going to show you how the seats work. Your headrests have little levers on the sides which flip them down and then everything is numbered. So we have number one lever and then we have a number two lever. To fold them down, we're going to pull number two, and then we're going to pull number one, and then they just fold right into the storage space below. Now, the front wheel drive comes as an eight passenger, and the all wheel drive comes as a seven passenger. With the eight passenger, you get the third center seat in the second row, which is removable. It can actually be stored right here as well. All right, so today, once again, we are looking at the LE, but there are many trim levels to the Sienna. There is an L, LE, SE, XLE, and Limited. So there are many, many different options, technology options, such as like a rear DVD, navigation, but today we're gonna to be looking at a more basic model. So you're gonna have all power windows, power locks, power window child safety locks. And then on your steering wheel, you're gonna have all of your controls easily located. So audio and Bluetooth controls. And then moving over to the right is all of your audio, which makes it very convenient because it's all right there. All your air controls are centrally located in the center, which controls driver's side, rear temperature, and passenger temperature. So you can control everything in the vehicle. So with these controls down here, it's going to show you different options on the smaller screen up top. If you hit info, it's going to give you average fuel economy, eco 
your current fuel economy, distance to empty, your average speed, and then of course your trip timer. It will also show all of your air controls um, right on that screen as well as a backup camera. You also have a storage tray down here with a non-slip grip pad with a USB and auxiliary cord below as well. We have plenty of storage. There's another storage spot in here. It's an extremely deep console. And then you also do have two storage spots up here. And of course, your glove box as well. Very nice. Well, Amanda, thank you for taking the time today to show us the Sienna. Not a problem, it's been my pleasure. The vehicle is a wonderful vehicle for all families. It's a versatile, reliable, dependable vehicle, has all the latest and greatest safety features with an overall five-star safety crash test rating. And Colonial will be happy to help you pick out your new vehicle with any option that you're looking to get into for any budget. We have plenty to choose from in stock, and if we don't have it, we'll be happy to get you one. Come join us under the gateway to savings. Meet Teddy at the new Colonial Toyota and make us your last stop for your best deal. Colonial! Now it's Auto Show TV's Best Buys. We search for the best cars in the market and tell you where to find the deals. Majestic Honda sells and leases a lot of Accords. Right now they feature the 2015 Accord LX with so much in standard technology for $179 a month on a 36 month lease. And that's with only $1,000 down at Majestic. If you're looking at a smaller sedan, Anchor Nissan has the 2014 Sentra SV discounted over $2,300. Buy it for just $16,814 or lease for three years and zero down. Plus you get Anchor's lifetime assurance plan. Or how about a move up to Maxima? This deal caught our eye this week, a 2014 Nissan Maxima S with a savings of over $8,000. That's a best buy. This Maxima is $24,050 at Anchor Nissan. And you can lease with zero down if you prefer. With the popularity of the all-new 2015 Honda Fit, there aren't a lot of huge discounts yet, but Majestic Honda did it. The Fit LX with its forward-thinking technology and Majestic is leasing this Fit for $149 a month. That is a no-brainer. One of the top-rated mid-size sedans year in and year out is the Subaru Legacy. They keep getting better and now the 2015 Legacy is out. Anchor Subaru has a great lease price of $269 a month for a 36-month term. The best part is zero down and you get Anchor's lifetime assurance plan as well. We found a great price now on a 2014 Dodge Charger, one of America's great muscle cars. Elmwood in East Providence has chargers starting at $22,999, save over $6,000, and 0% financing is available too. We noticed the popular 2014 Chevy Malibu at a great price at Cerrone's in South Attleboro. They've got a big construction project going on, so they are moving cars. This is a program Malibu at just $14,995, almost eight grand off MSRP. Also, a smaller SUV that packs so much for the money is the Chevy Captiva. This program Captiva, with low mileage, is just $16,995 at Cerrone's. That's ten dollars off the original price. Program Captiva is at Cerrone's. Anchor Nissan is selling a lot of the redesigned 2015 Rogues. They are so nice, and right now they have Rogues starting at $25,158. Nissan did such a great job with the new Rogue, and Anchor includes the lifetime assurance plan. Another small SUV that provides so much is the Honda CRV. The 2014 CRV can be yours on a $189 a month lease for 36 months. Another no brainer. This is at Majestic Honda in Lincoln and West Warwick. If you're looking for a smaller crossover, Subaru has the Crosstrek XV. Anchor Subaru has the 2014 Crosstrek starting at $21,490. That is a terrific price. We just reviewed the Crosstrek here on the show and we loved it. And at Anchor Subaru, they include the Anchor Lifetime Assurance Plan. If you've been waiting for the new 2015 Subaru Forester, Anchor Subaru has them now. And right now, they're offering the 2015 Forester 2.5i at just $21,790. What a price. They have lots of trim levels and colors to choose from at Anchor, and it includes the Anchor Lifetime Assurance Plan. They sell an awful lot of Ram pickups at Elmwood in East Providence. We found they're offering right now a 2014 Ram 1500 quad cab with the Ram box for $28,999 delivered. It's very nicely loaded up and save over five grand. Recently we featured the Chrysler Town & Country on Auto Show TV and sure enough Elmwood has put a really low price on the L model right now. They've slashed the price over $8,000. 
It's $35.99 at Elmwood and also 0% financing is available. That's Auto Show TV's Best Buys. For more info, go to our website, theautoshow.tv. Next up, Cerrone's is getting a new showroom. You're watching Auto Show TV. The official auto loan provider of Auto Show TV is Navigant Credit Union for all your new, used, and classic car and truck financing needs. You love everything about your new ride. It smells so good. But maybe you could be paying a little less for it. It's not too late, you know. Let Navigant Credit Union take a look at your rate. We could help you refinance and maybe save you a little every month. What could you do with the extra money? Hmm. Huh. Road trip, maybe? Navigant Credit Union. Enjoy life's journey. Hey, Jeff here at Village Motors with exciting news. We have over 100 vehicles in stock, all competitively priced, and come with an additional five-year, 100,000-mile warranty. Here's an example. Purchase this Toyota Solaro with 76,000 miles, and you'll have coverage till 2018 or 176,000 miles. So hurry down, pick your vehicle, and add an additional five years and 100,000 miles to its current mileage. So visit us and experience why we have become Rhode Island's largest certified pre-owned dealer. Village Motors, a higher standard in pre-owned vehicles. So how do I describe nostalgic and more? Well, we're definitely unique. That's why we say we're your not-so-general store. We carry classic rock and roll t-shirts, incense candles and oils, collectible vinyl record albums, nostalgic tin signs, work gloves, even Daytona motorcycle helmets, and lots of hard to find and rare treasures. Check our website for specials, nostalgic and more, celebrating our 20th anniversary in Attleboro. We're fun, energetic, and unique, just like our customers. Well, if you've seen the Cerrone commercials on TV this month, you know that they're undergoing a major construction project here on property. They're building a new showroom at Al Cerrone. Uh, this is very exciting. You must be like a little kid watching all this happen. I am, actually. Once I got by the cost of this, yeah. and I swallowed that pill, now we're ready. And, and seeing the progress and knowing they've started and how long it took to get the permits and all the red tape that goes along yeah. with it, Yes, I am excited. Excellent. So what's, what exactly is going on back here? Well, as you can see, they put the footing in. Yep. That's going to be the perimeter of the new showroom. So we here we are in front of the old service department. And of course, we used to have service and sales on opposite sides of the street. Now it's all going to be confined to one big lot, which is approximately six acres. So that's the way to go. It, it, it is. Ultimately, yep. I think it will be much more convenient for all of the workers here and the customers. But you know what? Rather than speculating what it's going to look like, let's go inside and look at the plans. Okay. So John, the, this is kind of like a master plan, a good overview of what we're doing here. This is the current service department building. Yep. And this is the new showroom, the proposed showroom that they're pouring the foundations for now. And it's actually going to wrap around. So the majority of the inventory lot will be on this side. So the people in the showroom can sit here and in the front. That way they can see and make sure they don't miss any customers entering in the front or on the side. They've got a pretty good panoramic view of the entire inventory. Yeah, and a lot more space out front, whereas you were real close to the road across the street. Exactly, and, and it, this will probably give us a good 100 plus feet to the road so we can display a few cars, but mostly have customer parking. When they pull in, they're gonna face the dealership and they're actually gonna see two separate showrooms. Yeah, can you talk about that a little bit? I think the, the viewers would be interested to know that the manufacturers really prompt you to construct your new showroom in their image a certain way. They, they do. I mean, you liken it to many corporations. I'll use McDonald's as an example. You notice how all the McDonald's look alike. They have the golden arches, but beyond that, the, sh the, the restaurants have a similar look, very similar look. Mm -hmm. Well, so with GM, they want Chevy dealerships to look alike. Not exactly alike, because there are a few designs you can pick from, but they want people to drive by and say, oh, that's a Chevrolet dealership. Right. Buick and GMC, a little bit different. But again, they want people to drive by and not rely on the words Buick GMC. They want to be able to identify that's Buick GMC. Yeah. And Cadillac also. We don't have Cadillac, but Caddy, of course, is part of General Motors. Yeah. And GM is helping to subsidize the dealers because they realize that they, they realize it's a very expensive project yeah 
Absolutely. So, you know, they're chipping in a little bit, and I think it's a great plan, and that also helps induce most dealers to want to buy into the right. program, when otherwise they may not, because, you know, you're looking at pretty big bucks to, to do this. Sure. Now, this rendering here is a little more blown up, and it's kind of sideways, but I see here's your GM half of the new showroom mm -hmm. and the Chevy half. Well, when you have duels, which we have, they don't want all of the products in one showroom, but they allow us to make one building, but it has to be divided in two. And they're actually two separate entries. When you pull in front of our new dealership, you're gonna see Chevy to the left, Buick GMC to the right, and it's separated by the wall. So if you're in one, you actually have to walk out and in the front door of the other. Well, Al, bottom line, I know much of this is because you want this to be a great customer experience when they come in a brand new showroom. Exactly. I mean, the intention of General Motors, as well as the Cerrone family, is to better serve the customer. And with a brand new showroom, not walking across the street, two separate showrooms, nicer offices, nicer facilities, air conditioning, all the amenities, bottom line is I think it'll make it for a much more pleasurable experience. And the staff has to be excited. Oh, they are. Well, 23 years in the old building, it, you know, is basic but functional. Yeah. It's time for change. Yeah. Now, how's your dad doing with all this? How's Smokey feel about this change? Well, that's another old story. I see. You know, Dad, Smokey is uh, old school. He's 85 years old, and I think that he thinks it still costs about 200,000 to build all of this. <laughs> so we're kind of keeping him in the dark yeah. as to what it really costs. <laughs> so while all of this is going on, you still have to stay open and sell cars. We do, and you know, outside of a little choreography here, trying to you know navigate the fencing and the one ways and all the construction, we have to sell every single day like every other dealership does. Yep. And as a matter of fact, this month we've got two incredible specials. We've got the 2014 Chevy Malibu, which is a mid-sized car, but it's great on gas. It's over right. 30 miles per gallon and they're 14,995. And of course, we've got the Captiva, which is a great little SUV, which I drive one, gets great gas mileage. And we've got those for 16,995. So still open for business, just like any other day with the construction. So what's the timetable on getting all of this completed? I would say late spring 2015. It's only seven or eight months away, and we should have it all buttoned up. Coming up next, the versatile Subaru Crosstrek. You're watching Auto Show TV. At Cerrone, we're building a new showroom to better serve you. But this construction's taking up a lot of space, so we need to make deals. Like these 2014 Malibus, only $14,995. We need to make space. Come to Cerrone's. I'll be glad you did. You love everything about your new ride. It smells so good. But maybe you could be paying a little less for it. It's not too late, you know. Let Navigant Credit Union take a look at your rate. We could help you refinance and maybe save you a little every month. What could you do with the extra money? Hmm. Road trip, maybe? Navigant Credit Union. Enjoy life's journey. Distracted driving can be deadly. You're 23 times more likely to be involved in an accident while texting and driving. Don't become another statistic. I'm attorney Larry Signori. Don't text and drive. If you'd like more information about any of the dealers and deals you've seen on today's show or would like to view previous episodes of Auto Show TV, go to our website, theautoshow.tv. At Cerrone's, we've got the help, but we need to make room. That's why these 2014 Captivas are only $16,995. You save almost $10,000. The new building's going up, but our prices are coming down. See them all at CerroneGM.com. Good morning. We're back at Anchor Subaru for an auto intelligence walk around of the smart, practical, and fun to drive Subaru XV Crosstrek. The Subaru Crosstrek combines symmetrical all-wheel drive, a high safety rating, and lots of room for five. The XV Crosstrek has great ground clearance, excellent gas mileage for an all-wheel drive vehicle, and comes in either a five-speed manual or CVT transmission. And now for 2014, the Crosstrek comes as a hybrid. So let's get a closer look at both models here at Anchor Subaru. Joining us this morning is Sean Murray to tell us all about the Crosstrek. Victoria, we have two different models here for the Crosstrek. 
Newest to our fleet is the hybrid technology. The hybrid technology is getting a little bit better fuel economy and a little bit better power than the normal Crosstrek. The Crosstrek itself is a brand new design for Subaru. It's lifted 8.7 inches off the ground and it's considered a compact and not a small SUV. Okay, so we have the hybrid right here. The hybrid comes in a wild color of the lime green. Mm -hmm. You've got the hybrid engine. It's still the same two liter four cylinder engine and then it comes with the parallel hybrid system similar to that of the Toyota Prius. Victoria, how do you like those wheels? I like them a lot, they're very nice. Those wheels are standard on all Crosstrek trim levels. This happens to be a limited, so it does come complete with the power moonroof. All of the Crosstreks are gonna be this high off the ground as well, so you're gonna have 8.7 inches of clearance, which does make it different than some of the other models to give you a little bit better clearance for those off-road conditions. The roof rails are also standard on all of the Crosstrek models. The roof rails help for cargo, ski racks, bike racks, and things like that. Moving to the back here, you have this nice trim as well. This trim breaks it up nice with the different color schemes, and it also makes it rugged so it handles those rocks and things that will kick up on the highway when you're driving. Right. If you want to come around here, the hatchback is really cool. A lot of hatchbacks designs, they open up, but they're kind of short, so people that are in the six feet tall range kind of hit their head. This hatchback, it opens up nice and tall to give you a lot of clearance, okay? In the back here, you have plenty of cargo space, and the seats fold down, it's a 60-40 split. And then you have this nice cargo cover that will come over and it will hide everything in the back for you. You also have this nice tray, which a lot of the Subarus do come with. This tray, I like to snowboard, for example, and if you put all of your uh, stuff in there, you can take it out and hose it down when it's dirty. Great. Safety-wise, we have airbags in the front, the seats, the side pillars, and you have rear pillar airbags. So this car has a top safety pick plus rating for rollover, side collision, rear collision, and front collision. That's great. <laughs> Very important on the Crosstrek, it ha does have a pretty good towing capacity of 1,500 pounds. And then if you see here, you have a nice cutout so the trailer hitch is very easy to install and they're all pre-wired for it as well. All right, Victoria, welcome to the inside of the Crosstrek. As you can tell, you have plenty of space. They made it nice and big so you have plenty of space between the driver and the passenger and you have plenty of leg room. The leg room does continue in the back seat as well so for those passengers, they're not claustrophobic back there and it's really nice. In the front, you have a steering wheel that's telescopic and tilt, so it goes up and down, in and out. On the left side of the steering wheel, you have your volume control, track up and track down, and mode select to go through AM, FM, CD, and satellite radio for the radio unit itself. The remaining three buttons are for your Bluetooth hands-free. If somebody calls in, it'll display their name on the screen right there, and you can talk, and their voice will come through all the speakers inside the car. If you want to start it up for me, I'll show you the rest of the features. On the right side of the steering wheel, you have cruise control, which is also standard in all of the models. Mm -hmm. Also notice behind the steering wheel, you have those cool paddle shifters. So in the front here, you have the navigation system. It's a six inch screen and it's full touch screen. Go ahead and hold the brake for me and put it into reverse. It also brings up your full color backup camera. Your backup camera has green, yellow, and red lines, and that's be able to judge the distance that you're coming to that object. All right, so you also have your rear defrost. If you push your rear defrost, I've just activated, of course, the rear defrost, mm -hmm. your heated side mirrors, and your heated windshield wipers as well. Oh, very nice. The voice recognition for the navigation system is phenomenal. You can also use that button for your Bluetooth, so you can press it and you can tell it to call Sean Murray at Anchor Subaru, and it'll dial the number immediately. On the top here, you have uh, information display. It's 73 degrees outside, 90 miles until empty, which is extremely accurate. It also tells you that your gas tank is on the passenger side, and then it gives you the current time. We have heated seats in the front. Those switches are located right here. Mm -hmm. You have a high and low setting, and that's only for the front, pass front passenger and driver. In the center console, if you lift up, you have your USB for your iPod. You have a 3.5 millimeter headphone jack for any other MP3 player, and then you have your power outlet. Victoria, before you go today, I really want to talk to you about the hybrid just a little bit. It's important that people know about the hybrid because the hybrid technology is brand new to Subaru. However, Subaru does carry a trait that they don't push technology that's brand new. They're utilizing the technology that Toyota has used for several years on their Prius. So the technology is proven and it also works very well alongside with our oil drive. On the outside, there are a couple of differences with the hybrid. You have the turn signal LEDs in the mirrors. You have the different wheels. The wheels color scheme is the same but they kind of made it a little opposite, putting a little bit more silver in there, mm -hmm. a little less black. Right. In the back, you have full LED taillights, more efficiency, uses less power. And then you have the chrome door handles, which add a little bit of a nicer touch as cosmetic. We have many 
hybrid and regular cross treks all in different trim levels and colors. Also, it's very important to know starting July 1st, 2014 here at Anchor Subaru, we have lifetime warranty on all of our brand new vehicles. That includes the engine, the transmission, and the all-wheel drive system. And that's another great reason to buy here at Anchor Subaru, located right here on 146 in North Smithfield, Rhode Island. Well, you know, Auto Intelligence recommends only a few select used car dealerships in Rhode Island and southeastern Massachusetts. And this is one of them, Ted's Auto Sales on Route 6 in Somerset and Mark Mannion. Reputation, you sell good quality used cars, and I know you've got some new inventory you want to show our viewers this morning. We're going to start with the Chrysler 200? Yep, sure is everything. We have the first car to show you here is a 2012 Chrysler 200. Stylish, affordable, efficient, with a five-star crash test safety rating. Still under factory warranty. We have it on special for the show price this week, only $10,995. Next on the show, 2006 Chevy HHR LT. Superior functionality, visibility, all with a nice retro look. Don't forget the goodies. Leather heated seats and moonroof. Price specially for the show, this week at only $79.95. Next one speaks for itself. Fashionably rugged with great American heritage. 2002 Jeep Wrangler Sport, all pre-lifted for you. We've done everything with the big three. Auto, AC, hardtop, side steps, beautiful pearly tires, only 56,000 miles, not 156, 56 original thousand miles. On special this week, come grab it, 12,995. So you're tired of looking at the trucks with 100,000 miles that are still 17,989. How about this 2005 Nissan Titan SE King Cab 4x4 with the off-road package. Features the side steps, superior ground clearance, skid plates, only 69,000 miles, $14,995, comes fully serviced. Come get it, it's heads. Just in 2004 Dodge Ram SLT Quad Cab 4x4 with the sport package. And even awesome hood scoop, 20 inch chrome wheels, sliding rear window, soft tonneau cover, tow package, this week's special, only $14,995. The nice little 4x4 truck you've been waiting for heading into the winter, right here. 2004 Ford Ranger FX4 package, extended cab V6, shift on the fly, four wheel drive, bed liner, immaculate inside and out. You won't find one this nice in the area. Priced specially for the show at only $99.95. Comes fully serviced. Thanks again for checking out our segment on Auto Show TV. Again, my name is Mark, and not only do we have a great sales department, we also specialize in full service and financing. You can visit our website at tedsautosalesinc.com, fill out an application, we'll get you pre-approved. And we're also at 508-677-9517. Thanks so much. Hey, just a last reminder, here at Cerrone's, they're still open for business during this construction project. They're still open for sales and service here on Route 1 in South Attleboro. I'm John Coletto. Have a safe week on the roads. Don't drink and drive, and don't text and drive. This has been Auto Show TV, produced in cooperation with Auto Intelligence. Thanks to our participating dealers and sponsors. This has been Auto Show TV.